Hey YouTube, I'm in this uh, 2012 Ford Escape Limited, and it has the Active Park Assist. You push that button there when you're looking for a spot. I'm going to show you guys a little demonstration on exactly how it works. So now, basically, you want to drive around. I'm driving down this street. There's some parallel parking spots here. I want to push the button here, and now this thing will say Active Park Searching. Now it's going to look for a spot, and it's supposed. I'm trying to get it to park right there. So hopefully it'll tell me, spot found, space found, put hands in reverse. Now i got to put it in reverse, so now it says caution, back up. So now this thing is using the cameras and sensors around the car. And it, see, I'm not, my hands aren't in the wheel. It's going to do the steering for me, which I'm hoping it doesn't hit anything. This is pretty scary, because I'm not uh, actually turning the car. The car is turning itself, and you can see it's... It's getting itself in there. The beepers, backup sensors are all working. I was actually going for the other spot, but I guess I'm gonna park behind this truck. And I'm basically just working the brake. The car is steering for me while I'm working the brake. Wow, that is really useful. Look at that, look at that. Active park finished, put it in drive. Wow, the active park assist is a 395 option and it works. It really works. That, this is my first time actually seeing it in action. So if you guys are, if you guys are pretty bad at parallel parking, and you don't want to learn, which I know how to parallel park. I know a lot of my friends don't. Um, get that 395 option for the parallel, the active park, especially if you live in the city. But uh, thanks for watching, guys.